Philippines is an interesting country to visit. Aside from its pristine white beaches, Philippines has more to offer, its people and culture. Today, let us talk about 5 best or unusual things about being a Filipino. Number 5. Filipinos are obsessed with basketball. The culture of the Philippines is deeply intertwined with basketball. In this country, courts may be found everywhere. It could be hanging on a tree, a coconut tree, and even at the light poles on the streets with both children and adults playing with their improvised rings and unconventional facilities. Filipinos are so obsessed, I mean so obsessed with this game, that they even play in the midst of a calamity. Before we proceed, don't forget to subscribe to our channel or this centipede will crawl on your face during your sleep. Number 4. Filipinos love to eat. Who doesn't, right? But in the Philippines, we have three official meals a day and, mm, you know, a couple of unofficial meals. One of the facts that any visitor should be aware of is that the locals love of dining. We start our day by indulging in a cup of hot coffee and a handful of baha or pandesal before officially starting to prepare for breakfasts. It's not also uncommon to see Filipinos enjoying a mid-morning snack of coffee and bread, followed by lunch and then a late afternoon snack called as merienda before hitting the table again for dinner at night. So don't be surprised if you see water heaters and rice cookers being plugged in a thousand times throughout the day. Number 3. Filipinos love to sing. Karaoke is a big deal in Filipino culture. Almost all houses in the Philippines are blasting different genres of music. From copying the melodic voice of Barbra Streisand to belting the killer notes of Maria Carey. Filipinos from all ages could pull that out, euphoniously. Whether one knows how to sing or not, karaoke is so popular in the Philippines that even families living in a Nipa hut have their own karaoke set. So once you visit this country, you better prepare your vocal cords to avoid it from ripping off your throat. Number 2. Filipinos are addicted to boxing. When Manny Pacquiao, the world-famous Filipino fighter, has a televised fight, it appears to be a national holiday throughout the country due to the lack of cars on the road and even people in the mall. This is because Filipinos are glued to their television sets, eagerly anticipating Manny Pacquiao's victory. The Philippine National Police has even reported a decrease in crime in Metro Manila whenever Manny Pacquiao fights. In fact, during Pacquiao and De La Hoya's 12-round fight in 2008, the National Police recorded a zero crime rate in Metro Manila. Before you proceed, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe before these two huge eyes will haunt your night. Number 1. Christmas is a big deal. Christmas traditionally begins in September. Yes, you heard me right. September. Shopping bazaar starts to spring out all over the city and mall starts to play holiday music. Christmas is such a big deal in the Philippines that homes begin to decorate as early as September. Additionally, throughout the Christmas season, Filipinos participate in a number of religious activities. One of these is the Night Mass or Simbangabi, during which Filipinos attend nine consecutive early morning mass services leading up to Christmas Eve because Filipinos believe that completing this mass will grant your life wishes. Do you agree in our list? Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to get notified.